Hey guys, welcome back to the Rainbow Reels with Panos. I'm Matt. We are back to episode 11 of Kaiju number 8. Last episode was crazy. Yes. Huge fights. Huge, huge fights. We saw Kaiju number 10 being eliminated. Yes. But Kaiju number 10 left a little surprise bomb. And Kaiju, Kaiju number 8 had to save the day. Yes. But Kafka's secret was revealed. So, let's dive right in. Let's go. Let's go. How are we going straight in? Mm. Oh no! Don't dispose of him! Oh, that's the thing is dead, no? That is his dad, her dad, yes. And they want, they want to have him handed over. Interesting! Catch number eight, capture. He's the nicest guy. Absolutely. Like. He's just a normal human. He is a human that can turn into a kaiju. Yeah. Not a kaiju that can turn into a human. Damn. Damn. <sighs> I mean, yes, <laughs> you were a kaiju. So, yes, they are upset. <laughs> Imagine me like, excuse me, can I please pee? <laughs> oh, not all of them. What are they saying? What are they thinking? This is heartbreaking. Yeah, oh. <laughs> Oh, bless him. Yes. Yes. Give him some hope. It's uh, uh. ジュナ姿に驚いたけど、同時に思った。カフカ君らしいなって。今、君に有利な証言や映像を集めてる。人間であると証明できれば、処分を避けられるかもしれない。ジェスミナ。俺はまだお前の隣に目指していいのかな。
日々のカフカの処分撤回をお願いしに参りました私自身彼に命を救われていますそんなくだらん失態の話をしに来たのか<笑>しかし見てみろ奴の胸部 X 線画像だ左胸にあるもの心臓によく似せてあるが核だ<笑>やつは人間ではない怪獣だ<笑>お前の母親を殺した怪獣なのだ What? A kaiju like the one that killed your mother? Wait. Stop it. He's not a human? I guess if he's got a core, then that makes him. But we saw that kaiju core into him, and then he transformed. But I guess it's like a parasite. So instead of the heart, he now has a core or something. So they're gonna experiment on him. What are they gonna do? Oh. And also breaking out isn't easy because I'm assuming because he's underwater? It needs to be rebuilt. I mean, it took significant damage. ボエタイナイブと事情なので詳細は言えないのですがどうしても助けたい男がいるんです自衛隊の元上司と電話してたカフカの処分に口を聞いてくれそうなお偉いさんに繋いでくれああ人間だと証明してみんなの元へ帰
Oh, oh this is Kafka. crazy. But he, he can't attack. Well, because it is. Yeah. Number two. So they used that kaiju to turn it into the suit. Wow, this is giving Godzilla, eh? <laughs> How strong was kaiju number two? I wonder if Kafka is stronger. Yeah, he's the Whoa! only one to ever be able to use it. Oh. Why? <gasps> no. Mm, don't, 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 don't. This is crazy to me. This is crazy to me. Amazing. Okay, really Amazing. Enough. Uh oh. Uh oh, Kafka? Where's Kafka? <gasps> Is he losing control? The kaiju took over. No. No. <gasps> He's transforming even more. Oh no, this is what they wanted. No. This is the worst possible time for him to lose control. <gasps> Oh, this is the thing that entered his body. No, don't do it. Wow, he moves like death. Don't kill him. Oh no. T please don't. No! Oh! <laughs> no! Cause... No! <laughs> Why are they doing this to us? Oh, <laughs> one more week, one more episode, and then it's over. No. <sighs> this is stressing me out. What do you think? Well, I was happy to see in the beginning that everybody was still rooting for him. Including Mina. The whole division, including yeah. Mina. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Um, and then they brought him to this facility, underwater facility. The headquarter, yeah, yeah, the head headquarter. And I just kept thinking, I hope they're not going to experiment on him, I hope they're not going to torture him. And they didn't. Well, they took some x-rays and some blood. Yeah. Yeah. But then now, suddenly, they want to kill him. He like, what did he say? Commence? Disposal. Disposal. Um... And Damn. I guess, yeah, they want to kill him, and then they want to turn him, turn him into a weapon as well. Yes. It was interesting, obviously, that when they mentioned that they took the, those x-rays, and he doesn't have a heart anymore. That I don't understand. So he says he's not a human, he's kaiju. Yeah, he's got a core now. So he's not... So he's not... So he's not a human, and he doesn't become a kaiju when he turns into a kaiju. He is a kaiju at all time that can switch between forms. So similar to kaiju number nine, right? Yeah. I'm assuming. But then does it mean that this creature that, by the way, is still there. We saw that little parasite appear at the end now. So does it mean that the, 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 um, does it mean that this creature, that parasite ate the heart and turned him into a kaiju and therefore he has a core or was he a kaiju? that was awakened through the parasite, right? Because if the heart is gone, well, yeah. like what happened to the heart? No, I do think just that the, the whatever entered him had to, it's like a parasite, right? And it's swapped out the heart for a core. Okay. Right. I guess there needs to be a core so that you can transform Become into a kaiju. A kaiju. I hope they're going to explain it a bit more, right? Because when he says, oh, he's not a, he's not a human, he's a kaiju, it's like, okay, but tell us a little more. Yeah. Anyway, 
Um, right, her dad is obviously badass. He's like, no, no, these are the rules. This is the protocol. We're going to kill him. Uh, we're going to turn him into a weapon. He hates kaiju yeah. because... Yeah, the, so what happened to the mother? His wife killed. Yes. He said, he said, um, this is a similar kaiju that killed your mother. So something like this has happened before where kaiju was... Did he say similar? Yeah, he said something similar, no? Something similar happened to them. So it looks like he's not the first kaiju to be a human. And also kaiju number nine doesn't appear to be the first kaiju that can turn into a human. Um, but anyway, we also learn that he has those super fists that are from kaiju number two. Mm. Which was the second biggest kaiju to appear, obviously. Otherwise it wouldn't yeah, be kaiju number like two. like a long time ago, 1972. 1972. Um, and it does look like he is the only one who can use these um, fists. Yes. That obviously mer- merge into the... Suit. Into the suit. That looked very cool. Um, and then he started punching him. It's not just punching him, but really punching off those, the uh, limbs. At first it was like, oh, he's actually just um, trying to like provoke him. Mm. He wants to fight with him to see really how strong he yeah, is. Yeah, it's but... like, can he wants to see if Kafka can stay in control, right? And then can they use him? Do you think? For their own purposes. But then obviously that didn't, wasn't the case. Like no, he really he wants to kill him. Kill him. Um, and then unfortunately, like it does happen that Kafka is losing control. So I have a bit of a theory here. Kaiju number eight took control and isn't allowing Kafka to take back control because this is a, um, a life or death situation. Yeah. And Kaiju number eight doesn't want to die. So I'm assuming that Parasite is taking control and saying, no, no, if we do not fight, we will be killed. Yeah. And ki- dying here is not an option. Yeah. The, the Parasite might be like, babe, <laughs> I didn't choose you a couple of weeks ago in that hospital room to now be killed because you're too good of a human. Yeah. No, no, no. Let me take over. But then that begs the question is like, why... Hasn't it taken over before? Because Kafka would have not allowed fatal damage. But now F- Kafka is allowing fatal damage because Kafka doesn't want to fight the father, right? But he's yeah, taking but like, what damage is, what is to this Kaiju's point? agenda? Because it the Kaiju seems wants like to survive. It, it could have taken over completely at any time. But already. that's what I'm saying. That's what I'm saying. At no point in time was this Kaiju ever fully threatened, hmm. right? Here... This kaiju is about to be killed. That's what I mean. That's why the kaiju is taking over now. Yeah. The kaiju is saying, I'm taking over. Because you are going to allow this dude over here to kill you. Right? And that's why you see he goes into this berserk mode. At the end, yeah. you saw how he was moving like a like a shadow. That looked incredible. So that's what, what I think. Because it's just said, kill, kill, kill. Right? So at this point, it is. What do you say? The, the, the saying is, kill or be killed. Yeah, it will be interesting to see afterwards if he's going to give the control back to Kafka. Once he kills the enemy, that's the question. Yeah, or if he actually now wants to fully take over the body, right? Well, I mean, again, it's just a theory. What if, so he might let go of the control of control if mm. the threat is neutralized, right? So I'm having another theory. I could see them fight, obviously, in the next episode. And you saw already, they're in this control room up above where mm. Shinomiya is, yes. right? Hikoro. And she watches. So, and, and that glass has shattered already. So I'm thinking, what if that control room gets damaged? She then is suddenly in the arena. Mm. And Kafka is about to kill the father. And she yes. jumps in front. And that's and when stops. Kafka stops. Exactly. Because he sees her. Yeah, could be. Something like that. And then because she saves her dad's life, she turns up to the dad and says, Daddy, I'm the boss now. <laughs> you let him live. Yeah. <laughs> but, I mean, so there is going to be another season because I was reading that there are different arcs as well. Mm. So it's a bigger manga with different arcs. So I'm assuming he's not going to be killed. But it will be interesting to see how this turns out because yeah. clearly there's multiple stages here. You can see suddenly he's losing control. Exactly. What else could happen to him that we don't know of? You know? Yeah. But because now they saw like he lost control, like how can they trust him? Right? Because in their mind is like, oh, this could happen again. Yeah. And what if we don't have 
I don't know, the general around with his with his number two fists or I don't know, Mina or or thinking. Yeah. Um uh, Hoshina. Hoshina's humor is always funny. He's <laughs> like, no, 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 I need him back here. Yeah. I need to fight him again. Um, and then you can also see that uh, his uh, his colleagues are, are calling up people to try and, and you know, get yeah, favors. Yeah, just doing everything to, yeah. to help them. So it is nice to see that they all care for him. But bottom line, he did save a lot of people, you know. A, he saved all of them at the end. But even between, he saved, you know, uh, Reno and, and uh, Iharu he saved. Obviously, he, he, he saved Shinomiya. Which I totally had forgotten, by the way. Yeah. When she said, oh, he saved me. I was like, oh, yes, he did. Mm. That was the first time they encountered number nine. Um, yeah, he did save a lot of people. So, but It's almost said, like they don't care that he saved no. the whole division, you know? They, they just see like, oh, he's, he's a, kaiju. a kaiju. He's a threat. He could lose control at any moment. Yeah. Maybe this is all just a game, like he's pretending. But actually, his plan is to wipe us all out. Well, and that's why it would be good to have more of that backstory from from uh, the general and and Kikoro, right? Mm. What happened to the mother? I mean, how did this kaiju that they briefly talked about kill her? Mm. And he's obviously, he's reached a point where he's not listening to anybody. Yeah. He doesn't trust, I think he doesn't trust anybody. He's like, no, 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 this kaiju needs to go. Um, and he's the general, so, you know, he has the last word yeah. at the end of the day. Um you know, I would like to know what his combat power is. I'm assuming 100%. Because Minas is what? 96? Uh, yes. So I and they did say he was he was the strongest. He was the strongest, right, so. so I'm assuming 100. But then also interesting what Kafka said. is like, oh, I'm just going to dodge for as long as I need until the suit over overheats. <laughs> but then who knows what suit he's wearing. His suit, he his suit might like, not overheat. You, it might overheat in five minutes but in those five minutes you've dead. lost your legs and your arms already a so. couple of times over yes see that's something as well that we never had answered how often can kafka uh, regrow and regenerate yeah. i guess in fit like infinitely until the core is damaged no i don't know that's anyway it. episode 11 i can't believe that we have one more to go and then it's the end it's one of my favorites you like it a lot. Mm -hmm. So thanks for being with us. There's so much more on the channel. We're going to link it down below. And we're going to see you for the last episode. Final episodes. Next week. Take care. Bye.